So, <laughs> sadly, um, I hope you can hear me because my voice is running. My video today is sponsored by Honey. <laughs> But um, I really wanted to talk about this because it's super exciting. There's an amazing conference coming up. I mean, conference season's coming, right? But there's one that's really, really kind of making me excited. I wasn't able to attend last year, but I'm ecstatic to attend this year. Um, the Woodall Sexual Freedom Summit, yeah. <laughs> there's something, ooh, I almost fell. There's something kind of special about this one. Woodhall provides an open, safe space dedicated to talking about sexual rights. I mean, we're kind of in a really scary place right now. To have a space where human rights activists, sexual educators, and researchers, professionals from legal and medical fields, authors, sexual freedom movement leaders, and so many others can come and talk about all their work and their thoughts and sit and like co-share that is where it all starts, <laughs> where it all starts to bloom, right? It's where the changes start to happen. So thinking about that conference and, you know, thinking about what sexual freedom means to me, it means so many things. I'd love to share them with you. Sexual freedom means snuggling up with my lover, drinking dandelion tea with our legs entangled. Being able to lay on our bosom as we talk about things that inspire us. Sexual freedom means having multiple lovers and being loved from different, different, words are hard, <laughs> different parts of the world. Sexual freedom means sitting and talking to my mother about sex and not being embarrassed. In fact, sharing stories while feeling safe, safe enough to answer the questions open and honestly as she asks. Sexual freedom means being able to have accurate sexual education in schools. Sexual freedom means being able to call yourself a slut and taking a hold of what that means for you. Not being judged by the number of bodies that you've connected with, rather than just being yourself. Sexual freedom means to walk down the street and feel completely comfortable in whatever I chose to wear that day and with who I'm sleeping with. Sexual freedom to me means everything. Sexual freedom means that you can be yourself. It's real scary these days, but it's kind of like taking a breath. Without sexual freedom, I feel stuck. I feel incomplete. Sexual freedom means you don't have to live multiple lives because you feel safe enough to move through the world in your own skin that you found that peace and connection within yourself. Sexual freedom is to feel empowered and to be sexy, to be you. Sexual freedom as a woman is what I'm fighting for. It's funny, and actually not funny, when I meet older women and we kind of share the same scrunched up RBF face because they've already fought this fight and it's something I'm fighting for, so they're confused that the fight's still going on, and I'm confused if what got lost in translation that we're having to do it all over again. Sexual freedom means that my goddaughters can go to the bathroom, any bathroom, and it not being labeled by a gender. It's taken me a long time to get right here in this chair to say out loud that I'm a queer, polyamory, loving black queen. I value that I've created a safe family that allows me to be all these things and more that allows me to thrive every day and to be a sex educator sexual freedom is something that you can't merely put into a few words because sadly it's something we're fighting for every day let's keep fighting the good fight